Hi everyone, welcome to a new video. This video is all about how to use Como CRM. As you know, Como is a platform where you can manage your work. If you are a person related to sales, marketing like CRM or in general you are managing project, then this platform is for you where you can manage all your work related to your customers, your clients and marketing stuff. Also, if you would like to use how to use its CRM related stuff, so this video is for you. Using this platform is super easy and very simple. You just have to follow a few steps and you can easily use it. So to use this one, first you have to go to the browser and there you have to search for Como or you can find its link in the description below. You can either go with a link into the description or you can get its link from the result. Once you click onto it, you will get onto its website. So this will be the first interface that you will see. So there we have two options, either we can go for login or we can go for sign up. So if you don't have an account then you can go for try it for free but if you have one then just simply click on this option login. Therefore I am clicking on it and here you can see that I have just logged into my account. This is the home interface of Como, this is how it looks. We have a lot of options almost all over the screen. On the left side we have multiple options. First we have this option called dashboard. If you click on it you will see all the related stuff to your account or to your work. On the top of it we have a timeline. Let's say if you only want to see the work that has happened today then you can click on this option. If you want to see the work that has happened yesterday there we have this option and likewise we have different options or you can use the custom time and then you will see the work within that timeline. Here we have different kind of options this will show you like how much work is done what is left which person has done which work and all our activities related to your work if you click on this second option leads then if you want to create any kind of leads you can also create it to create a lead by yourself you have to click here and fill off of this information which is related to your lead later on once it's created you can move it to its right part from there you can just simply move it to there and so on you can move from one step to other step or if you want to create a lead you can just simply click on this option and a new lead will be created other than that we have this option which is chat so here you will see all the chats and channels related to your work and in this option you will see all the tasks like what tasks are for today and what tasks will for today if you want to create a new one you can also create and after that we have these options there you will see all the contacts that you have added of your customer and other stuff likewise we have few other options that you can click and explore like this one is analytics there you will see all the details ups and downs related to your work so if you want to create any kind of task you have to get onto this page and then click onto this option new task and after that you have to give a title to your task it could be anything if you want to send emails then you can just simply type here email for customer or any other option so whatever this option is related to you have to click on it and after that you can choose when you have to complete it and then after that it will be completed later on you can move it if you want to move it to today you can also do that and if you would like to edit that task you just have to simply click on it later on you can do some changes to it and it will work according to what changes you have made or even you can delete this one and after that if you would like to create any kind of lead or maybe any kind of taskbar you can just simply explore different options fill up these options and the work that you want to do will be completed like here we will create a lead so first we have to add this information this information will be related to the client or maybe the potential customer who has sent you a lead or maybe you have received it from any other source of your choice. Once you have got that one you just have to fill up this information according to what you have received. If you have received the name of your client then add up here, add detail and everything whatever options written up here you have to just simply add it here. And once you add this information your lead will be created likewise if you want to create more leads then you have to fill up this information according to your potential customers data and click on this option and after that lead will be created once it moves to the second step 
you have to do that like one by one you have to keep moving it so you will get to know which lead is in which state so you can work on to it according to its need otherwise there are other options also available you can explore all of these through these all options you can contribute in crm and you can make your relationship better with your customers by managing the customer relation management which is crm on como so here you can generate different kind of leads you can create different tasks you can add your members your members will manage your work and in your dashboard and analytics you will get to know all about your business or maybe your project like how much work is done what is left your progress and what has to be done where are the weak points where you have to work more and everything about it and that's it thank you so much for watching the video and make sure to subscribe to youtube channel